Hey guys, this week on the show, we're with pro staff member Brandon Murphy here. Him and his son Bryson are gonna to try to get it done today on a couple whitetails. Y'all stick with us. My son Bryson Murphy was uh, was doing a muzzleloader hunt and we found this one location and uh, we had to have a northwest wind for it. This deer was funneling out of a bottom up the ridge because there's a lot of white oak acorns left and uh, we got a northwest wind on the last afternoon and so we put a blind up, brushed it in real good, put Bryson in. You're going to see what happens next. All these deer just started working up this bottom. But then we had a little technical difficulty with the audio and I did not realize that at the time. So. There was a lot going on during this hunt. I hate you have to miss that because there was so many does that was trying to figure out which doe he was on, which doe had the camera on. But it all come together, guys. Just check it out. Alright guys, it finally happened. The man here, Bryson, he laid a shot on this doe. This is the last day of muzzleloading here in North Carolina. And uh, 
We've been trying hard. He's laid with it every weekend. He's got up early. He's done everything he could do. He even practiced shooting today during lunch. And uh, so we're, tr we're truly blessed. It's just a big doe. And uh, he made a, just a heck of a shot with the Traditions 50 caliber muzzleloader. And he's seven year old. So you can't beat that, guys. What do you got to say, Bryce? It's so awesome that I can kill a doe. Pretty proud of that, huh? Mm hmm. That was fun, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. That got you pumping? Mm -hmm. You can get to do some blood trailing today too, huh? Mm -hmm. All right. All right, guys, we're going to take this thing, get it field dressed and processed and everything. But I'm Brandon, and I, this is Bryce and my son with Trophy Room Adventures. I'd like to thank you for watching. All right, guys. So I'm the owner of BRM's Wild Adventures as well. And I took my son the very next week after we harvested this doe to Wisconsin to one of my featured destinations that I have. And this hunt was amazing, guys. We had bucks the whole time that we was there. Just a great opportunity. It's American Adventures Ranch with me. And uh, just follow us this week and watch my son take his first buck with a 308. All right, guys. I'm having to crouch down here a little bit. We're in this tight box blind. But we finally made it, guys. We're here in Wisconsin, American Adventures Ranch. It's our first night, guys. Bryson's ready to rock, so we've got everything set up. So just uh, stick with us, guys. Right off the bat, Brandon and uh, Bryson here, their first evening in the stand, they see these two really nice bucks. Uh, that's not really what they're after. They're up here looking for a management buck to take off the farm. And uh, maybe they won't have to wait too long before Bryson gets his chance. This 10 point that we was after, he was just a beautiful buck. He come in the day before we harvested him, we seen him that afternoon and he comes straight down the road and we never could get Bryson on an angle because he was on the field pot. So when he come in, he just come straight towards us guys, went straight across the blind and we just could not make a shot. And if you ever seen a little seven year old heartbroken, he was that day.
after taking a short break and eating lunch and kind of getting everything back together, we went back out that afternoon to the same stand that we was in the day before that we seen the buck. And shortly after we got set up in the blind, we looked to the end of the road and the buck come out, just appeared out of nowhere. And boy, the excitement went through the roof. Bryson was shaking. He had these little crocodile tears in his eyes. He was really concerned that, you know, that he wasn't going to make a good shot. And he got really nervous. So we had to do a lot of talking him through. And you might can hear in the audio me trying to talk him and calm him down a little bit because he had done shot a doe the previous week. So, but he was able to pull it all together, guys. And he laid just an awesome shot down on this buck. So check it out. Well, guys, as y'all can hear there, Bryson is really tore up about this buck being in front of him. And you can't blame him. He's seven years old. This will be his first buck he's ever taken. But just pay attention here how Brandon's trying to calm him down and uh, listen to the excitement in his voice. Thank you. 
As y'all can hear, Brandon is talking to Bryson. He's trying to get him calmed down, trying to get him to take his time, make a good shot, encouraging him, telling him he can do it. And uh, Brandon is so focused on helping Bryson that he almost misses the shot. But uh, he comes through at the last second, gets the camera turned around, and uh, gets everything on film. Kill a big buck. All right, guys, he just smoked him. I seen him pile up, guys. We got him two days. We've been working hard. It's happened. It has happened. <laughs> All right, guys, we finally got it done tonight. We're up in Wisconsin. Bryson smoked this awesome 10 pointer. He wants to tell you a little bit about how it all happened. It came out in the field, and I got on the scope. And I laid the smack down. All right, he laid the smack down. You heard that, guys. So we just want to thank Rick up here at American Adventures Ranch. What an awesome place. They really take care of you, feed you good. The hospitality is amazing. If you want to see bugs like this, you just need to get in touch with us. Thanks. All right, guys, that was just one awesome trip. That's, like I said, that's one of my featured destinations at BRM's Wild Adventures. I offer hunts all across the country, even in Canada. So if you want a trip of a lifetime, you want to see bucks like Bryson did and have this experience and be videoed with a chance to be on the Pursuit Channel with Trophy Room Adventures TV, you need to contact BRM's Wild Adventures. Thank you. Guys, as y'all can see, I've been lucky enough to uh, make a trip to South Africa before, uh, this, judging by this nice kudu I have here in front of me. But we're headed back August the 12th, 2018 with Abula Safaris. And uh, we're going to take one of you guys along with us for free. That's right, we're doing a contest, uh, we're doing a giveaway. Us and Abula Safaris have teamed up and we are taking one of you guys with us for free on a seven day safari. Check us out on Facebook, go to our Facebook page, Trophy Room Adventures TV. Find the official giveaway post, it's pinned to the top of the page. Read it, do what it says, and you'll be entered to win this once of a lifetime trip with us to South Africa with Abula Safaris. We've also got some spaces available on this trip. If you just want to come along, you want to be part of the TRA gang, uh, be part of BRM's Wild Adventures, our trip over here with Nancy at Abula Safaris, all you got to do is contact either us at Trophy River Adventures, BRM's Wild Adventures, or Nancy Delfino at Abula Safaris. And our contact information is on the Facebook page, on the post. So you guys, if you want to come to South Africa, be part of the show, We'd love to have you. We've got a few spaces left. Just get in touch with us and we'll make it happen. Guys, this is a strange looking whitetail I know, but if you're interested in coming to Ohio to hunt trophy whitetails with us here at Trophy Room Adventures, all you gotta do is look us up, write us a note, send us a letter, whatever you need to do to get in touch with us, just get in touch with us. We'll get you up here. We'll get you on a big whitetail, get you filmed and get you put on the show. Check us out at www.trophyroomadventures.com and uh, we look forward to hearing you guys.
Alrighty. Look at the look at the camera and be pretty. <laughs> hey guys, today we're uh, blah blah blah, and I done screwed up. I'd like to have the I'd like to have the prompt for right here. Yeah. I ain't got that high tech yet. You need to say what's up. Yeah. Make it sound all professional with a 308. Sweet. You're freaking professional. And uh, we're going after some planes game. <sighs> Crap. Now, uh, now this looks a lot different than the whitetails that you're used to seeing me with. Well, guys, this is a strange looking whitetail, I know. But uh, if you're interested in coming to, with us to... 